Hey y'all, Arson Darksy here, and there's a thunderstorm going on, so if you hear a bunch of noises or my dog's crying, it's because there's a thunderstorm. But, thank you, Ocean. <laughs> there's a video I've been waiting several days to share with you all, because knowing that this exists makes me beyond sick and disgusted and furious. And if I think about it too long, I'm going to get really angry and go on a tangent, so let me try to keep this as short as possible. There's this pretty new show uh, in Denmark, I believe, and it is a children's show. I repeat, it is not for adults. It is for children. As if it would really make a difference to me anyways. But, um... <laughs> This show, I mean, it is so obvious what's going on, I shouldn't really have to say anything. But these demons are doing everything they can to program the world into enabling the incoming legalization of you know what affilia. And I am just so sick of it. I'm so tired of it. I want to claw a creep's eyes out. I'm so angry. Anyways, <laughs> let's just take a breath. I plead the blood of Jesus over all of the viewers' eye gates and ear gates and skin gates. I plead the blood of Jesus over their minds. And Lord, I ask you to protect all of us from the disgusting junk we're about to witness. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. I'm just so pissed off. <laughs> really, it's been several days. Probably two weeks, maybe even more, since I downloaded this clip. And thinking about it makes me so angry. So here we go. Look at this junk. Ugh. Since the beginning of this year, there's been a new show there that's got a lot of attention. Denmark's flagship broadcaster has just introduced a new children's show called John Dillermond that's essentially an animation about a man with a huge and uncontrollable penis. This man has a penis so massive and flexible it can save children from danger, fetch objects from a river, and even operate as a pogo stick. Yeah, it's true. Denmark has a kid's show called John Dillermond. The dealer in Dillermann is Danish slang for penis, which is a perfect name for a man with a magical dong. In his show, he uses it to walk some dogs, as you can see here. He also uses it as a tightrope in a circus act and to decorate a Christmas tree. The show started airing in January and was an instant hit, with the first episode being viewed by more than 250,000 children. It's so much more imaginative than what passes for children's entertainment here. None of these characters can hold a candle to John Dielemann because I guarantee none of them have ever saved a group of drowning children by using the centrifugal force of their cartoonishly long schlong. And the fascinating thing is that John Dielemann is not really an outlier in Danish kids' TV. Danish culture routinely addresses topics with children. In public TV, there are kids' programs that include a puppet coming to terms with their gender identity, a pirate who tries to join a satanic cult. The problem is there are some, both in but especially outside Denmark, who can't seem to get their head around the charms of this show. Our penises aren't necessarily sexual, are they? No, they're multi-talented. He can even make penis animals. Oh, a giraffe! Fancy!